Hey, this is Rob. Welcome to the next part of Let's Play Dink Small. In this part, we'll just be collecting gold to buy the flame boy, and that's it. So let's get straight into it. All right, let's start by going up here and killing the monsters up this secret path. We're going to kill the monsters in this area and in Windermere, in between gambling at the ducks to get 25,000 gold and get the flame boy. That's the main point of this video, of this part. It was practically the main point of the last part as well. But yeah, in this part, I'm not going to be going to all the towns, only this area right here and Windermere and killing the monsters and in between killing the monsters I'll gamble at the ducks and then whenever the monsters reappear I'll go back and kill them speed up the duck gambling part so then you don't have to watch it because it will take a long time so let's go back down here and I'll kill the pill bugs on the way back the ones that I skipped and then we'll go to Windermere and kill the monsters so let's kill these I might try to get some hearts I've got some life taken off down there but that's not really essential because I doubt I'll die in this part on these monsters. To die right now with my stats and at this part, I would really have to suck balls at this game. So let's go to Windermere and kill the monsters. And I will kill the slimes, like I said. Uh, hopefully they'll drop some hearts, but it doesn't really matter if they don't. It's not absolutely necessary to click the hearts. So we'll go up here and kill these. I like killing the strong monsters because they drop a lot of gold. The faster pill bugs that drop gold don't really drop that much. Like the slayers and grey bonkers, they drop them a fair bit. And sorry if you can hear like I have a wind howling noise in the mic. There's a window back there that won't shut properly. It's pissing me off because it's howling like a bitch. And it's hailing and blowing a gale out there, so. Yep, I doubt the mic will be able to pick it up, but if you can hear any of that, then I apologise. Whatever. Like I said, I doubt the mic. I doubt you'll be able to hear it. What I always found weird was that throughout the game, the, the grey bonkers are really the only ones that attack other monsters to begin with when you walk in the screen. Like all monsters, if they're hit by another monster, they'll lock onto it. But I'm pretty sure the grey bon bonkers on any screen, or like, they're the ones that attack all the other monsters. That's why they come across as psychos. So yeah, oh, there might be, yeah, I think there's a couple in the Darklands as well, but mostly it's the Grey Bongers. I think the Dragons do as well. But yeah, whatever. Okay, let's gamble at this duck. This is a risk because I haven't saved it, so if I lose, I'm practically screwed if I lose my money. Because I haven't saved it. And I won, so holy crap, thank god, let's go and save it right now. That is good luck, I usually have the worst luck ever. And this part is going to be pretty long, because of my luck with the ducks, I'll have to load 10 billion times. But, can you blame me? No, you can't. And if you do blame me, then, fuck you. But, let's speed it up right here. Because, to make you watch this whole thing in normal speed, would be a punishment of the cruelest kind. Because really, like I said, my luck sucks the major ass. I'm speeding this up real fast here, so really it'll go past really quick. The monsters, when the monsters appear back, I'll float down again and show me killing them in that. Because it's more interesting than watching me go backwards and forwards to ducks. Okay, so let's go up here and kill the monsters again. More gold. Make Dink a millionaire, a $25,000, I mean, yeah. Well, that doesn't make any sense. Yep. See, I hate it when that happens. The Hellfire, like, goes straight through them real fast and only hits each one once. It goes faster than it's supposed to. It's really annoying. I don't know why it happens. It's like a bug with Dink's Mold or something. But, cool. Whatever. Sweet. Now, let's go down here and we'll kill all these slimes, because I feel like it. Die. And then we'll go to Windermere and kill the monsters there again, for the second time. And you can multiply that by 10, and you might get how many times in total I might be going backwards and forwards, killing the monsters and gambling at the ducks. So let's go and own the monsters. And I, I was making this part of the LP before, and basically I had to start again. Like this, this part I had to start again. Because I was halfway through making it and it was starting to hail. I'm like, oh shit, 
had to run outside and wind down all the car windows and whatever and shut the doors and whatnot like a bitch stupid hail okay now we can go up here and kill the rest of the monsters uh, I'm probably not gonna have much to say in this part uh, like I said in the previous part when I didn't have much to say but I ended up saying stuff anyway random crap that yeah doesn't really relate to the part or doesn't make much sense but yeah, I probably won't have much to say because I'm not really going to any new areas. We're not exploring any new things. I'm just collecting the gold. Now this duck gambling thing, it might not be fun to watch, but you gotta trust me. It's, it's damn fun to, to play. Gambling's always fun. Especially on Dink Smallwood when you're gambling with killer ducks. And that was a risk right there. I lost my money and then got it back and I hadn't saved it. And I'm damn lucky I won because usually when I lose, I keep losing. That was luck right there, something I don't get much of. And usually it's because of them cocky little freaking gambling ducks. You know, the gambling itself might be fun on here, but not the goddamn cocky little smart ass ducks that I can bet on one all the freaking time. And look, let me give you an example of my bad luck. Look at this. Look at that piece of goddamn shit! Look at that! Does duck number one ever win? Goddamn that cocky little piece of crap! This duck is the most cocky little fag you will come across in the whole game. It's the shittiest non-enemy ever, and he gets a 100 on the fagometer. And I ask myself why killing ducks is fun. Well let me tell you, I'd kill that piece of crap any day. Now let's speed this up and get this duck gambling over and done with. Now as you can see, I've sped it up super fast, and that's because I went back with the ball with a lot between the duck game, playing the duck game. And you really don't want to see that, like I said. But anyway, the monsters have probably appeared back by now, that's how fast I sped it up. So let's kill them. <laughs> 